From the Pentagon on the Potomac, across from the Washington Monument, the Department of Defense directs the worldwide activities of our armed forces. Secretary of Defense Robert S. McNamara heads the Civilian Military High Command. He acts for the Commander-in-Chief, the President, and this is his report to you. And now, Secretary McNamara. In the past year, after three years of intensive buildup, our armed forces have shown that we now have the capability to meet any communist challenge and to meet it on any level, whether that be nuclear, conventional, or local. The communists have demonstrated time and time again that they will push against weakness and that they will retreat in the face of superior strength. This is very clearly the foundation of their strategy. And therefore, the foundation of our military strategy must be to stay stronger than the communists. Today, we have a flexible fighting team ready to deal with any threat, whether it be large or small. We are superior to the communists in nuclear power, and we intend to stay that way. Freedom is indivisible, and we can best protect ours as partners in freedom for all. In 1963, our nuclear weapons for strategic alert forces show an increase of 100...